Hey there guys, Pocket the Monster here, back for more Pocket the Monster Emerald. And last time we kind of crapped all the Pokemon, beat a, a pirate guy who told us about his plans in the next city, like, a, like an idiot, and now we're talking to this guy. I like filling my mouth with seeds and spinning them out fast. You can have this too, so, tr so you can try it out. Using our Pokemon, we'll learn a move for firing seeds rapidly. And we got TM09. Yes, the best TM ever. And what is what is that TM? He's not gonna tell us. Well, screw you too. But you know, I'm I'm not even gonna read, it, man. Just just let me let me see what this is real quick. Please be something useful. Oh, bullet seed. Power of ten. Shoots two to five seeds in a row to strike the foe. Yep. That's nice. That's real useful. Thanks a lot, buddy. Like, seriously, I could teach that to Trico, but I think Absorb would do more damage. Like, I get it would be multi, it would be a multi hit move, but seriously, you know what? You know what? Screw it. No, I'm actually, I'm, I'm just gonna, I'm, I'm gonna teach that to Trico because why the crap not? Because honestly, why? I, I, I don't really have any use for this, to be honest. I can just teach it to Trico, and like, it's not like I'm, it's not like something I want to keep or anything, so. I might as well just teach the Trico, get rid of Pound because it's the same. It's the same power as Quick Attack, and 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 Quick Attack has priority. So yeah, get the get get the get Pound out of there. Oh my God, I can't freaking talk. Get Pound out of there. Let's go ahead and move on. Pretty Petal Flower Shop. Yeah, I think I'm gonna avoid this place. Okay, fine. We'll go inside. All right, let's see what they got in here. If I if I were a Pokemon trainer, I would never step foot in this place. But since this is in the game, they might give us something cool. Hello, this is the Pretty Petal Flower Shop, spreading flowers all over the world. Yay! Your name is Brendan. That's a nice name. Brendan, would you like to learn about berries? Sure. As long as you give me something at the end of this. Berries grow on trees that thrive only in soft, lonely soil. If you take some berries, be sure to plant them. One, plant one in the lonely soil again. A plant berry will soon sprout, grow into a plant, flower beautifully, then grow berries again. So exciting! I want to see the whole world filled with beautiful flowers. That's my dream. Please help me, Brandon, plant berries. Why the crap did I listen to all of that and you gave me nothing? This, what is this, Willy Wonka in the Chocolate Factory was like, You get nothing! You lose! That, that's how I feel right now after listening to all of that. Okay, yes, the more attention you give the flowers, the more beautifully they bloom. You like tending flowers, I'm sure of it. You can have. Oh my goodness, this this she was so much more helpful. Like she shortened she shortened her words and she actually gave us something. Ugh. It's like seriously, man. That, that's all I'm really in here for. Just just give me what I need to strive as a Pokemon master. Though I don't think berries really would help all that much. Okay, and she's gonna give us a Lepa Berry. I think that restores 10 PP to one of your moves. So yeah. That's what the leopard berry does. Yes, and they have machines where you can make pokey block. Yay! I, I think I'll sh I think I'll try to do that, but that's a lot later on where you can do that. Like a lot later on. I'm talking. I'm when I say a lot later, I'm talking about when we have like like six badges in, and we have no badges right now. So yeah, that's not that's not really gonna help us right now. And wow, I think I need to I think I need to use some potions on my Pokemon because they're actually getting kind of weak. So let's go ahead and do that. Go to my bag, get my potions. I only have four potions, man. Like I know that I know trainers don't really give you a lot. Actually, I think Ralt is good. Yeah, I think I'm gonna hold off on Ralt for now because Ralt, Ralt, Ralt may not look it, but he's a pretty strong. He's a strong little guy. So you know what? If you got if you if you guys missed the last episode where Ralts put in work, you guys have to check it out. Because honestly, you will never see a Ralts put in as much work as mine has. Like seriously. A Poochiana? Really? Like, what is this? Like Poochiana number 150,000? Like come on, man. I am so tired of seeing Poochiana. Just stop it. Like seriously, you know, when they evolve into Miana, they get a really good ability, Intimidate, which lowers the Pokemon's attack stat. But other than that, its stats are god awful. Oh my god, it's so bad. Like, ugh, it makes me sick thinking about it. Like, ugh, it's just, it's just that dark type that you don't want to use. All right, it's, it's kind of like Lyapurd in, in from Unova. You don't want to use that Pokemon. Like. I think Lyapurd might actually be more useful than Mighty Anna now that I think about it because it gets Fake Out and some other moves as well that really help it out, but Mighty Anna, it does not get jacked. Like, seriously, maybe you'll get, like, Crunch 
and swagger and that's all I can really think of. Maybe Iron Tail or Dig? That's all I can really think of for it. In the Hoenn region, there are pairs of trainers who challenge others for two-on-two -two Pokemon battles called Double Battles. In a Double Battle, the trainer must send out two Pokemon, no crap. The one at the left of the list and the top one. Watch how Pokemon are lined up. Yes, of course, we know this already. We are a, we are a Pokemon master. Oh sure, I'll accept your challenge, I have a lot of money. Well, I'm a, I'm a Pokemon master in Pokemon Yellow. That was my, that was, if you guys didn't know, that was my first LP. But yeah, that, but you know, that was a long time ago. We are now in Hoenn, and we have a brand new start. So let's get it on with this Zigzagoon. Get it on with that Zigzag, oh god, oh my word choice. Oh god, oh wow, I was gonna I was gonna make fun of that tackle, but that actually did a little more than I thought. That, that, well, I said that kind of weird, it's like, I thought. Wow, that was, that was kind of weird, but whatever. Why couldn't I win? Because you have a level 7 Zigzagoon. What is wrong with you, man? Come on now. Alright, let's go ahead and change up our party, because Ralts is actually falling behind by, a, by like three levels. Actually, two levels, wow. I can math. Alright, so let's go ahead and challenge this lady. Should I or shouldn't I? Okay, sure, I will battle. Like, uh, like you looked at me and you walked you walked up to me. You walked like three feet up to me. Like, why wouldn't you battle me? Like, what else are what, what else were you there for? Like, come on now. Be be a li have a little common sense. Even though Pokemon doesn't really have much common sense to begin with, but we won't dwell on that. Oh god, the ground, my attack on a special attacker, oh no, no, my attack fell, oh god, that really did nothing. Congrats, Lotad, you're the best. Okay, what else is next? Shroomish, alright, we can, we can deal with the Shroomish, no problem, right? Plus, we have synchronizes our ability, so even if it tries to pull some bullcrap like stun scoring us, he'll get paralyzed too. Okay, so he's just attacking us. It's kind of funny, Shroomish has such a low attack stat, but then when it evolves into Breloom, it has such a monstrous attack stat. It's base 130, which is freaking insane. So yeah, it's kind of difficult to raise in the beginning, but it, no, actually no, compared to Lotad and C Dot, no. You'll, you will want to go with Shroomish over those two because, oh my god, I shouldn't have battled. Well, no crap, Waltz is too freaking powerful for you. But yeah, if you want if you want a grass type, do not go for Lotad or or uh, or uh, Dot because honestly, those Pokemon, uh, they are not easy to raise in the beginning, so it's going to take a lot of work. And honestly, if it came down to just Lotad and Dot, I would just go for Lotad because you can at least teach Lotad's the, uh, the HM Surf eventually, but C Dot does not get anything for a long time. We are twins, so we battle together. Yay! All right, so let's honestly, if we if do, if we lose to a couple of little girls, I will quit. I will quit everything. I will quit. I will quit this LP. I will quit being a Pokemon trainer. I will quit everything. Oh my God! All right, so let's go ahead and confusion this low tag, and I guess we can. Quick attack the low, you know, let's just go ahead and be a jerk and just double team this poor little low tad. Yeah, let's just go ahead and do that because honestly, there's not much we can really do. Because that, honestly, in, in a double battle, it might be, I don't know, it might not always be the best thing, but double teaming a Pokemon in a double battle seems to be the best thing to do. Just get, it can just get one out of the way, to be honest, and let, make it, yeah, oh, wow, Ralts, you are, why is Ralts putting in so much damage? Holy crap, man. But yeah, honestly, attacking attacking the one Pokemon and then attacking the next seems to be the best strategy. At least, at least it works for me. If but everyone has their own battle style. Restboro City's up ahead, but we're not ready for that yet because Ralts is still level nine. Why keep it a secret? I'm the Water Pokemon expert. Huh? You don't know me? Well, no, I don't really know you, buddies. Like seriously, I I just met you. Like I, well, have you been on TV or something? Or uh, I. Oh. Yeah, yeah, why the crap would I know a guy with a freaking magic card? Come on now. Like, I'm just thankful we haven't run into that one trainer that has six magic card because, ugh, that is a pain in the butt, to say the least. Like, who, why does Game Freak make it so there's six magic card? Why? Six magic card in each game. I, do, I don't understand the fisherman with the six match. Uh, it just doesn't make any sense to me. It's just so annoying and time consuming. They like seriously, magic card give no experiences you can see, and they just don't do anything, man. They just don't. 
Like, one time I was, like, a long time ago, and, like, plat I was playing Pokemon Platinum, right? And I battled this guy with, like, six Magikarp only because they give away speed EVs. That's the only reason I did it, because it seemed like the easiest thing to do at the time, so that's what I did. So, yeah, that's the only use I can see for battling a guy with six Magikarp. I thought I wasn't too bad, if I may say so, but I guess not. Blech. What made you think- what? What made you think you weren't bad? You don't even have any attacking moves. You found two cherry berries. Yes, pick the berries while I wipe my mind of that terrible battle. Ugh. Alright, and what have we got here? Two leper berries. Nice. I mean, it's it's nice to have because actually Rolls is low on PP, but we're really close to the next town, so it really doesn't even matter. Yeah, make sure you plant the berry in the same spot. That's common courtesy. Here, I'll share I'll share this with you. And we got the Chesto Berry. Interruptions are always the best, but now we're back and we got a Chesto Berry. The way you look, you must be a trainer, no? Trainers often make Pokemon hold berries. It's up to you whether to grow berries or use them. I think I'll just use them because honestly, I think... <laughs> I'm not really gonna. Ta I don't know if I'm gonna take the time to really grow berries, but yeah, there's actually something I want to get here. But we are in Rustboro City, but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and pick this up. We got X Defend, which I'm pro. You know what? I usually never use X items in battles, so I might actually try to do that. I don't know. I in the next gym battle, I may try to do that. So in the next episode. Like, let me, let me know, guys. Do you want me to use X items, or do you just find it cheap, and maybe I shouldn't do that? But just, just let me know in the comment section, and I'll decide if I will use X... But I'll, I'll decide if I use battle items in the next episode. Westboro City, the city probing the integration of nature and science. Aww. If a Pokemon gains experience in battles, it can sometimes change the way it looks. A Pokemon changes shape? If one did that, I would be shocked. Oh, snap. Would you be thunder shocked? <laughs> yeah. Wow, you have Pokemon with you too. When I get better, bigger, I'm gonna go places with Pokemon too. Well, good for you. All right, so let's go to the Mart and pick up some potions because seriously, we have we have like two potions. All right, let's go ahead and pick up some potions, and we're gonna want some Pokeballs, of course. Give me my Pokeballs. All right. Okay, we should be all set to go. And actually, hold up, hold up, hold up. The saving grace. How could I forget the saving grace of any Pokemon game? Give me, hand over these repels. I don't care if this makes me dirt poor. I will be dirt poor if it means I, ha I don't have to keep running into Pokemon every five seconds. Because that would be freaking convenient for me. So let's go ahead and get that and we are out of there. So let's go ahead and also we need to heal up our Pokemon because of course that's the most important thing. That's why we went to the Pokemon first. <laughs> yeah, I I care about my Pokemon guys, I swear. Oh god, okay, let's just go ahead and heal up our Pokemon. And honestly, I think I'm gonna deposit slap wait, what? Uh, what what the crap? Uh, 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 no freaking way. Little is known about the Pokerus except they are like that they are microscopic microscopic life forms that attach to Pokemon. While infected, Pokemon are said to grow exceptionally well. What the crap are you Okay, if you guys don't know what Pokerus is, oh my oh my that is such a rare occurrence. If you if you if you guys don't know what Pokerus is, it's basically an infection, a good infection. Cause honestly it'll make your Pokemon get like I don't know how many EVs, but it'll help them grow really well and really fast. So that is actually really cool. I did not expect that. That is real. That is actually really rare. So I'm glad I was able to show that off. Wow. Okay. I did not think that was ever gonna happen. This LP, and it happens in the in the fourth freaking episode. Oh, that is incredible. But for now, I think I'm gonna just store Slack off here because honestly, wait. Does the Slack off have? The slack off have Pokerus? It okay, good. You know what? I don't know if it. I don't know if it wears off uh, in the PC or not because I'm not really sure about that. But I know it does wear off in three days. But yeah, that is freaking awesome that we got Pokerus. Holy crap! Pokemon Trainer School will teach you anything about Pokemon. All right, so let's go ahead and head in here. Wow, that is freaking insane. Oh god, this jerk that insult that insulted us earlier. Hello, didn't we meet before? I think back in Pellberg City. Let me introduce myself. My name's Scott. 
I've been traveling everywhere in search, of, in search of outstanding trainers. More specifically, I'm looking for Pokemon battle experts. So what brings what brings you to this school? Are you a trainer too? Wow, he really can't. Wow, he has dissed us twice, saying that we're we're a rookie. I mean, we are a rookie. He insulted us, and now he can't even tell if we're a trainer. What the? Uh, the first thing you should do is have a Pokemon learn the move cut. That crappy HM that every trainer has to use to get past those tiny trees. Yep, you'll have to learn that, buddy. Sorry. Like, seriously, why? Why do they make us do these terrible things? Honestly, ugh. Hey, I was trying to talk to you. Don't you walk away from me. Oh, wait. Um, students who don't, who don't get... Students who don't study get a, t a little taste of my quick claw. Whether or not you are a good student will be evident from the way you use this item. And we got the Quick Claw. We don't really have any, like, really slow Pokemon. Like, let me check out Ralts, because I know for a fact Ralts is going to be the slowest. Yeah, Taylor was... F Holy crap, Taylor was fast. But yeah, definitely not giving it to Taylor. Yeah, I think we'll just go ahead and hold off on that for now until we get, like, some really slow Pokemon. I guess it would be beneficial to put on Ralts, but... Uh, I don't, I don't, I don't really know about that. Honestly, I'd rather just put it on the slow Pokemon. So, yeah. Roxanne, the gym leader, really knows a lot about Pokemon. She's really strong, too. Oh, gee, I wonder how strong. The trainer school is excellent. If you study there, you can even become a gym leader. Oh, no, you can... You, no, guys, you can never be a gym leader. Which really sucks. I wish they'd let you, like, choose what you want to be instead of just collecting badges and fighting the Elite Four and yada yada yada. It'd be nice if you could choose, like, if you want to be a gym leader or not. That, I think that would be really cool. So, like, be a gym leader or a part of the Elite Four. Well, honestly, won't be... Wait, no. Why would you want to be an Elite Four member if you defeat the entire Elite Four and became a champion? Never mind, screw that idea. That determined expression, that limber way you move, and your well-trained Pokemon. You're obviously a skilled trainer. No, wait, don't say a word. I can tell just by looking at you. I'm sure that you can put this hidden machine to good use. No, no need to be monster shy. Go on, take it. Yes, we got one of the crappiest HMs to ever exist. Yes, that's what I've been waiting my whole life for. Yes, thank you so much. That hidden machine, or HM for short, is cut. An HM move is one that can be used by Pokemon outside of battle. And any Pokemon that's learned to cut can chop down thin trees if the trainer has earned a stone badge. And unlike a TM, an HM can be used more than once. Yes, of course. TMs, which there are plenty, there are tons more, there are tons of TMs that are way better than freaking cut, and yet cut is the only move that freaking stays with you throughout the entire game. Of course, how convenient. I use the term convenient loosely. Like, oh my, why? Why did they do that? Wow, this is a pretty tall building. Let's go ahead and check out what's in here, though. But seriously, ugh, why do... I wish Cut was leave me, because that's freaking terrible. Ugh. Devon's Corporation work... Devon's Corporation's workers live in this building. Okay. Yeah! Miss, what have you done to this skitty if it's crying out like that? Like, what? what is this? Yeah! Like... What have you been feeding this? Have you been like abusing this Pokemon? I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to call Nurse Jenny about this because wow, that really, that really doesn't seem right. A skinny should not sound like that. Yeah, like what is that? My daddy's work, my daddy's working at the corporation. My daddy made this, but I can't use it, so you can have it. A Premier Ball, not even bad. Actually, a Premier Ball just looks nice. It, re it really doesn't do anything, so. It, eh. Way back in the old days, Devon was just a teeny tiny company. Huh. And now, I guess it's a thriving company? I really don't know too much about Devon Corporation, because I, like, I guess they have the Sylph Scope and some other things. I don't freaking know. Devon's president likes to collect rare stones. Like, seriously, how do they make money exactly? I'm not really sure about that. I think the president's son also collects rare stones. Oh, wow, I wonder who that could be. It couldn't possibly be anyone we we are going to meet in the future. Nudge, nudge, hint, hint, wink, wink. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, we're gonna go ahead and get out of this building. Like, seriously, we went, we went inside there and all we got was a freaking Premier Ball. Eh, whatever. But you know what? I think I'm going to end things off here. Wait, 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 hold up, hold up. I think there's something up this way as well. So you know what? We're not gonna end it off yet because I think there might be something good here. 
Exploring a cave isn't like walking on a road. You never know when wild Pokemon will appear. It's full of suspense. R yes, we know. Rustboro City is right behind us. We are not stupid. Thank you, sign. Yeah. And we got... Okay, yeah, there is something here. Something worthwhile actually is here. Nice. A super potion, so we can make good use of that. That heals 50 HP, so that would be good for later. So, yeah, but now... Actually, why do I keep thinking I'm gonna end it off, but then there's always something more to do? This place is too freaking big. Ugh. So let's go ahead and talk to this guy. Huh, my Pokemon is cute? Sure, I knew that. But if you really want, I'm, I'm willing to trade it with you. I'll trade you my C-Dot for a Ralts if you want. What? What? Why the crap would I ever do that? Oh, no, that would be messed up if I accidentally... <laughs> <laughs> if I accidentally hit A on that, that would have been terrible. Who would ever want to do that in their right mind? Why? Ugh, that's, that's a disgusting trait. Ugh. In all sorts of places, there are all sorts of Pokemon and people. I find that fascinating, so I go to all sorts of places. Well, good. Well, you, you say that, and yet you're you're at home. It's like it's like daytime right now, and you're just here, just lounging around. I I really don't believe that guy. I he, just, he doesn't sound right to me. But yeah, let's see. Let's see if we can find the gym, or we can just find another random building to walk into. Right? Why not? Wait, haven't we been in here? Yeah, never mind. Wow, <laughs> I totally forgot I walked in this. Oh my goodness. Wow, this is all so disorganized. But you know what? I'll go ahead and end things here. After I go into this one house. Wow, I could not find a good place to end. Seriously. I just walked into that house. What is wrong with me? Okay, so you know what? Enough of, enough of this train wreck. I'm going to go ahead and end things here. So if you guys enjoy, like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time for more Pocket of Monster Emerald. We are coming for you, Roxanne. We will take you down with our green lizard. Pokemon thing. Yeah!